good morning dear friends how are you all hope all are fine students we are going to see now next poem that is the worm the worm standard 8th next poem the worm turn turn thy hasty foot aside nor crush that helpless worm the frame thy scornful looks deride required a god to form dear friends this is a very inspiring or very a uh, meaningful poem the god has given us a beautiful nature we must care for it okay we must not harm any creature or any insect or any animal so the poet is telling turn turn thy hasty foot a foot hasty means uh, hasty means hurried and careless okay hurried and careless means fast so they are telling take out your when you are walking don't walk so fast so that you may harm some insect or some creature so the poet is telling turn thy hasty foot and no, no, must not crush the helpless worm the frame thy scornful looks derided derided means hatred okay expressing hatred and scornful means hate okay filled with hate require a god to form so they are telling see don't be uh, hate uh, or don't be uh, uh, don't feel uh, fill yourself with hate okay don't express your hate hatred on the creature or on any animal the common lord of all the uh, all that move from that from whom thy being flowed a portion of his boundless love on that poor worm bestowed so the god the god who has made each one of us has created this all nature has created all animals all insects so we must not harm them he has be uh, uh, he has uh, created them with his boundless love okay boundless love means uh, there is no limit okay it is uh, the love which only god can give us nobody can give us so with love with care he has made this whole world so we, we must not uh be careful uh, careless and we must not harm anybody the sun the moon the stars he made to all his creatures free and spreads over earth the grassy blade for worms as well as the so the poet is telling the sun the moon the stars everything god has created okay it is free free of cost god has created with his boundless love and he he has given us a uh, grass okay he has spread everywhere on the earth grass for worms and for all of us so that we may enjoy on it let them enjoy their little day their lovely bliss received or do not lightly take away the life thou canst not give so the poet is telling see let them enjoy let everybody enjoy whatever the god has given us the creature and the uh, beautiful nature god has given to us with his boundless love so we all must be uh, so we all must uh, be free and we all must enjoy it must not harm anybody do not lightly take away take away means lightly means easily do not take everything easily the life that, that thou canst not give so the poet is telling do not take anything easily or do not take anything lightly which you cannot give okay which you cannot give and don't take the life of the creature okay so the poet is telling the life thou canst give that means the life to the others we cannot give okay no we cannot give but at least we must care them so dear students this is a very beautiful poem Uh, which is written by thomas gisborne the poet's name is the, uh, thomas gisborne he has told very uh, very beautifully that the world is very big huge and god has created every one of us we must care every little things every little bird and every little creature that is on the earth we must not crush them with our foot but we must care for them so dear students love nature and experience the nature and care for the nature thank you